A superstar is visiting Geelong yet again, and welcome to her, Christine Arnoux, joining us on News Geelong. Welcome to Geelong, Christine. It's so beautiful to be here. I thought I brought the sunshine, but now it's all rainy. Well, the sunshine's going to be appearing on the stage at the Geelong Performing Arts Centre, and you're going to be the main star. 20 years, styling up, is the big tour on. I know, to quote one of my... Can I? Can I, like, so egotistically... Um, quote one of my songs, Sunshine on a Rainy Day is me. Anyway, I will be in Geelong. Love love coming back to, to Geelong. I've been here with the Sapphires. Um, before that, it was Kissing Frogs 2002. Um, and more recently, um, uh, Rainbow's End. So I've, I love coming back to this place. And it's just, it's growing into a, such a pretty harbour city. And you and our wonderful Mayor, the colourful Darren Lyons, have got a little bit of the colloquial co collectiveness together. Honestly, um, I used to say that I didn't have friends in high places. Now I do. Giddy up. <laughs> He'll love that. What can we expect on the stage tomorrow night at the Geelong Performing Arts Centre? Um, look, Geelong Performing Arts Centre, it's, I will, let's just say nostalgia. And for all of us, it'll be a meeting place where I can share yarns with you and you can remember where you were the time party was released and we were all stepping out in our deadly red shoes. Now, can I say to everybody, hashtag deadly red shoes, try to turn up to my concert in your flash red shoes, why don't ya? That'll be wonderful. Uh, Christine, it's been a great journey for you. Uh, you uh, are also involved heavily in uh, Aboriginal and Torres Islanders women's affairs. Absolutely, passionate about that. Um, I must admit though, I didn't have anything to say for a very long time. My kids started growing up, as they do, asking about the world that they live in and all of a sudden I really needed for them to understand my opinion but at the same time have their own as an Indigenous person themselves. Um, you might not agree with my opinion and that's okay but you need to have one because we're Indigenous people and we're still trying to make this country of ours a better place to live in. And Christine, how do we find the music still in Christine Arnoux? Well, I'm always stepping out in my deadly red shoes and there's always a party in me and I'm always wanting to sing about my island home. So the music will always be in me no matter how far you go. Um, I've travelled around the world and I've taken this song to many places and, you know, just when I thought I was over singing My Island Home, I went into a room of expats in LA and I sang the verse of My Island Home, which was rewritten by Neil Murray. My home is Australia. We are a land bound by sea. And though I may travel far across the oceans, it'll never forget me. And they just got to their feet and exploded in this roar. And I realised that I should get over myself. This song is bigger than me and it belongs to the people. But you've been a wonderful ambassador for the song and uh, it has become part of Australia. And of course, we well remember 2000 uh, Olympics in the opening ceremony at the Paralympics in 2000. A wonderful moment. A beautiful moment. Look, I guess the world goes to an Olympic city representing the Olympics. Um, we're exposing everything that is Australian and to be chosen as one of the people that was going to be representing what we have to offer as far as music is in goes in Australia it was a wonderful privilege to be asked um, I, it was hard to keep my big trap shut though because it was all this top secrecy and not allowed to talk about it for so long but when we finally came out there it was just a wonderful experience they turned off the lights I was the opening act of the closing ceremony and um, I couldn't see a thing except for flickering lights and it was just me and silence and I'm getting goosebumps thinking about it but I was underneath the stage only moments before bawling my eyes out absolutely petrified and I remembered I had makeup on so I had the common sense to to lean over and made sure that my tears dropped into the grass and not down my face because there was no makeup artist to fix up my gorgeous makeup anyway I went out on stage and it was the most amazing feeling it was like everybody was right there the bubble the bling and the wonderful talent of Christine Arnoux and her dancing red shoes. Tomorrow night, Geelong Performing Arts Centre, a wonderful program. We wish you all the very best, as I think they say in show business, break a leg. Thank you so much, and remember, hashtag Dudley Red Shoes.